City of stars, are you shining just for me? No, it's shining for me and for you. It's shining for all movie fans because Oscar week is finally here. That means street closures and traffic and time for the Hollywood Reporter's final Oscar predictions. Awards analyst Scott Feinberg tells us who he thinks will win and chief film critic Todd McCarthy weighs in on who he believes should win. So first up, let's talk best actress. Who does Feinberg think will win? Emma Stone for La La Land. No, I'm happy for you. But who does McCarthy think should take home the Oscar? Isabelle Huppert for Elle. McCarthy said, it's always tough for a foreign language performance to take Oscar gold, but if Isabelle Huppert doesn't win, it will stand as one of the permanent Academy disgraces, along with Greta Garbo or Peter O'Toole, never winning competitive Oscars. Michel, il faut que tu signales ça à la police tout de suite. Pourquoi? Up next, best actor. Feinberg thinks the Oscar will likely go to Denzel Washington for Fences. I'm not talking about no baseball. You're not listening to me. I'm trying to explain it to you the best way I know how. But according to McCarthy, best actor should be Casey Affleck for Manchester by the Sea. It seems like he's doing pretty good, huh, considering? I think he is, yeah. Feinberg said, Manchester's Casey Affleck looked unbeatable. He won almost every early award, but an understated performance, uneven acceptance speeches, chatter about years old legal troubles, and a more famous opponent who gave a showy turn and beat him at the SAG Awards, which have predicted this category 13 years in a row, suggest he's vulnerable. Finally, the night's biggest honor, best picture. And we finally have a match for who the critics think will and should win. That's right, La La Land. You've never seen it. I've never seen it. Oh my. La La Land garnered a record-tying 14 nominations. As Feinberg pointed out, the other two films that got that many, All About Eve and Titanic, both won Best Picture. For the full list of 2017 Oscar predictions, be sure to check out THR.com and let me know your predictions in the comments below. Plus, for all the Academy Awards coverage you want, be sure to stick with us all the way through Oscar night. I'm Tiffany Taylor for The Hollywood Reporter News. This episode of The Hollywood Reporter News is brought to you by American Airlines, Hollywood's favorite airline.